see it. Oh my god. It smells like Jersey shrimp in this bitch. I'm Jersey shrimp. I'm dead. Fuck up. What? <laughs> yeah, that thing, Y'all see it? Y'all see it? I made it to YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. Getting money, I promise I feel like losing my empathy. Give a fuck what they talking about. Choose a hoe, I'm your enemy. Pussy sweeter than fruit. They lose such a sky do the who knows. 2020, the shit be cool. Beat on me, okay? She's cooking cool. Yeah, tell myself. Oh my god, I'm amazing. And then she got the bottle of her favorite recycle. And she put roses in that shit. Like, that's not fucking hot. Like, period. Yes. It smells like. It's day two, y'all. What up? I'm putting on my little press ons. I broke my motherfucking press ons. Um, yesterday was a good night. Yesterday was a great money night. I made some good money. But like, it was one of those nights where it was like, it was good for what day it was. You know what I mean? Like, it was giving weekend vibes, even though it wasn't a weekend. But I was waiting for my ride, and like, you know, like the management is all like, kiki up. You know, they talking to each other, whatever. And the club I work at is very, like, home-oriented type people. Like, these people have been working here since, like, for, like, 20-plus years type shit. So they always gossip. They always have some shit to say. And one of the staff members was, like, talking about how people weren't spending money because of the girls. And, like, during day shift, that there's no girls there. For people to spend money on da 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 and they were like it's the girl's fault it's the girl's fault like the girls just admit what makes the club bad da 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 and i'm looking at them like y'all i oh i had to i had to shut myself the fuck up i had to shut myself the fuck up because i'm looking like and let me let me tell you all about yourselves but because i couldn't say something to them i'm gonna say something to y'all because i um don't want to shit where i eat but i'm looking like it is not our fault that there's no girls here and there's no customers spending money. First of all, there's no girls here because the club opens at 12 o'clock during the day, right? Unless you have regulars, who's coming to the club at 12 o'clock? And then the type of customers that do go to the club at 12 o'clock, they're not like businessmen. They're not like any type of that. Like where this club is in Jersey, mind you. And the type of niggas that be over there be like, blue call like blue collar workers whatever whatever they're not spending money they're going in there to buy a little drink and we have to pry them to spend money and it's just not good quality customers now when it comes to like four five six o'clock 
there's more girls that come in because the customer quality is just better. So it's like, why the fuck do you want all these girls to come in mad early knowing that your customers is not shit? Like, what? And then you want to be mad at us that we're not coming in. Like, mind you, also at this club, like, it's a gentleman's club, so we can't give any dances upstairs. I can't even, like, sit in my customer's lap while he tips me. I can't even do all that. They have to go downstairs. They have to get a cut. The cut for this club is 55%. 55 motherfuckers. Y'all greedy as shit. 55%. Not 50%. 55%. The cut is mad high, and it's like, why would the girls come in early as fuck for y'all to take half their money, and we're not even allowed to give dances on the floor? Like, be so actually for real. Like, nigga, be so fucking for real. So, I'm listening to them, and I'm just like, y'all so mad dumb. Yeah, that's my little two cent, because the way they was all gathered around, like, yes, the girls fall it, da 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 Like, y'all look mad dumb. I was like, it's the girls' fault. The girls be in here hustling. Like, they is not lazy. There's not enough money for you to have girls come in at fucking 12 o'clock until 6 o'clock. And there's only going to be at least three customers who are really spending money. Like, what the fuck? Nigga, close the club later. Have some type of lunch deal where people would want to come in. Play some better music. They don't even have a lunch special. These are blue-collar workers getting off work to drink a drink before they go back to their job. And there's no food. Like, they're on their lunch break. Why the fuck do you not have food as a club? Like, be, be, be for real. Anyway, though, I'm going to go over there. But I would rather deal with them than dealing with the shit in Philly. Because Philly clubs don't even hire black girls at all. Let's talk about it. They don't even hire black girls in Philly. Like, y'all be asking me, what clubs do I, do I, should I work out in Philly? I don't even know what the fuck to tell you. Like. The clubs over there do not like they want you to be it's, it's it's just like Manhattan. Like they want you to be skinny and not dark skin. So when y'all be asking me like, what club should I work at? What club do you recommend? I don't even know what the fuck to tell y'all because I know how fucked up it is over here. Yeah. We better go to this bum ass club though. I don't wanna say it. it's not bummy. It's just like y'all need to be for real. <laughs> Like, stop blaming everything on the dancers. Like, it's y'all. But I digress. Okay, bye. After that, I went to Shamar Pierre's show in Philly on day three. And, yo, this show was so fucking good. This nigga had people boxing while he was performing. He sound like, like, like a hyper pop, pop smoke. He's so motherfucking good. This show was amazing. The preachers are working on getting for love. Come on, take it for love. Seems like he's never worked out. Is that a modified song in here? What's the wow? I'm not getting a little time. We've been talking all night long.